kind of share your feelings. There, there's a tremendous amount of material here. And uh, unless you had every minute of the last month to go over it and read it and figure it out, you really couldn't get a handle on the whole thing. I would have much preferred that we were given the zoning amendment and had an opportunity to really look at it closely and, and make sure we understood what it said and had time to really develop it before we were called to vote on it because it, it's, it's a big step. It's 175 plus acres. It's an addition to our city. I, I felt like the comprehensive plan and the meetings that we had, I don't think that the people that attended the meetings and voted in this comp plan really felt that something of this size was what they were talking about. I think they felt it was maybe smaller and maybe less less large and maybe it wasn't quite as sizable as this is and that does give me a little bit of heartburn about it because there's only one place that can qualify for a zone like this there's nobody else that would be able to come into the tr district that i can think of that would have a 300 room hotel a marina 175 acres uh an 18 course professionally uh, required golf course, can't say the right word. It, it's extremely large and it's a big thing. And, and I have a real problem sitting up here and trying to decide what's right and what's wrong and what the citizens really want. Do we want a town that large? Do we want our town to be a huge place or do we want it to, to be smaller? I don't know that we, we really have an answer to that. And, and it makes it very, very difficult to try to vote. I would like to have had a table, but I understand we're under a 30 day rule and it would have to be brought back up in 30 days and voted one way or another. Uh, specifically, I do have something that I wanted to 